Hi everybody, assalamualaikum, peace be on all of you. I'm so excited about this week. I actually lost weight. Um, in the beginning of the week, I started out well, but then a couple days into it, I had like this weight loss, I got into the weight loss rut, you know? Um, I wasn't exercising, I wasn't eating right. I just wasn't implementing what I knew that I should have. And then I felt guilty and then I started, you know, hating on myself for that and you know how it goes. And all of a sudden, in the middle of the week, I had this snap wake up saying, you know, this is my life right now is all I have. And honestly, I'd have to say that um, Auntie Shay's video, I'll put her link probably there, um, really helped me understand that, re-realize that, you know, if I don't like something about myself, then I can change it right now. And I think the main lesson that I learned this week, if you don't want to watch, you know, the clips that I've recorded of myself, I think the summary of it all is basically that instead of feeling guilty, you know, all week long, having that luring thought in the back of your mind, you know, like, oh, I have to exercise today. I still have to exercise today. Oh, what? You're eating this? It's so full of calories. You know, you know, like in the back of your mind, you're always thinking about weight loss, or at least I am, you know. It's like I feel guilty when I don't do something to change what I don't like about myself. Like uh, when I'm eating a chocolate pie and I know that I'm, you know, 30 pounds overweight, why, why am I eating, you know, this chocolate cupcake or chocolate brownie or, you know, too much spaghetti or this or that or, you know, McDonald's or Chick-fil-A, you know, just, there's, everything needs to be done in moderation, you know, there's so, basically what I learned this week is that if I don't like something about myself, why don't I change it, instead of just planning on changing it, instead of just thinking about changing it, instead of just having that constant nagging thought in the back of your mind saying, fat, fatty, fat, fat, fatty, you know, just change it, you know, if it wasn't for midweek me snapping out of it and saying you know this is my life I could have just gone on to gain weight I could have just gone on to slip off the bandwagon and I've done that before so many times I'm on the journey to a better to a healthier to the best me as possible because this is life this is my life and I don't want to see it pass by anymore Please join me on this weight loss journey. I'm so excited. You know, the little things matter. Last week, I tried to cut out packaged foods. This week, I tried to incorporate exercising a little bit more. Um, next week, hopefully, I don't know what I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to continue doing what I did last week. Exercise as much as possible and try to stay away from fast food and process packaged foods so that's what I'm doing and of course I'm counting calories and I'm also nursing thank God I'm still able to nurse that's 300 calories a day minimum 400 really but 300 is what I counted as anyhow talking too much so please join me on this journey please it's a lot more inspirational and a lot more motivating when other people are here along bye guys Salam alaikum. So, I'm so excited because I lost weight this week. Here's the weigh-in for this morning. Today is Saturday, Jan uh, February 5th. It's 155.8. Let's try this again, just to make sure. <laughs> yep, 155.8, that's really exciting! So yeah, I lost a total of 3.8 pounds, which is so great. I'm really happy. Tell me what did I do today? Did I use my time? Did I use my mind? If I search my heart, what will I find? The light of your guidance is a glimmering ray. Tell me what did I do today? Oh, Allah. What did I do today? What did I do today? What did I do today?